I'm Anil Kumar, sharing with you a very interesting question on even and odd functions. The question here is, if f of x is an odd function with only positive numbers in the domain 1 to 5, find its entire domain. That's the question for you. You can pause the video, answer the question, and look into my suggestions. Now, for an odd function, we have f of minus x equals to minus of f of x. Now, if we have some positive values, if we have only positive numbers in this domain from 1 to 5, that really means that if I reflect this about the origin, I should get uh, the negative values right, corresponding to those. Reflecting really means that these x values will become negative of what they are, right? So, so the domain will be union of this and the reflected values, which are from minus 1 to minus 5. Do you see that? So the domain, domain will be union of the given domain and its reflection about the origin, correct? Okay? So that is the answer for you. Now, if I change the equation, right, this was my question. Now, the question for you is, if f of x is an even function, not odd, even function, and rest all same with only positive values, or can write numbers, in the domain, of 1 and 5, find its entire domain, right? So my question is, will the entire domain be still the same? Well, think about it and answer the question. So I'm saying domain for this will also be minus 1 to minus 5 union 1 to 5. Right? Of course, since when it is even, it is symmetric about y-axis, so even then, these points will be kind of reflected and the x values will be correspondingly negative, between negative 5 and negative 1, right? So, so that way, uh, the domain of this function, I mean, remains the same. Uh, strictly speaking, let me correct this, I should not write like this. It should be written as negative 5, negative 1, since negative 5 is on the left side, right? So let me write this as, okay, not good. Negative 5 to negative 1. This is a better way of writing, okay? Anyway, so either way, we can place this question. If f of x is an odd function or an even function with only positive numbers in the given domain, then its entire domain will be a reflection of that domain, right? So... So we get the answer as mentioned here. I'm Anil Kumar and I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.